Hey everyone, in today's video I'll show you guys how to paint a waterfall landscape step by step. For this painting, I'm using acrylic paint from Pepeo. I'll add all of the materials I used in my description box. Before I get into the tutorial, I just want to talk to you guys about Skillshare. It's an amazing online learning network where you can find lots of classes related to fine arts and many other categories. Acrylic is a medium that I started not so long ago. I still feel like I need to learn many more techniques, so I tried searching for acrylic classes and I found some really good ones. You can find classes about acrylic painting related to techniques like gradients, limiting your color palette, blending different kind of colors, and much more. If you want to learn more about this medium, I really encourage you to check out the classes there. What's something you might like in Skillshare art classes a lot is that every step or technique is explained in a lot of details. You can use the link in my description to have two free months of Skillshare, and I think this is a really good way to check out the whole website and get familiar with it. Not only that, you just get to watch a lot of classes for free for two months. You don't have to sketch your waterfall and rocks since you will end up covering them in the first layer, but if this kind of guides you, then I would tell you to go for it. The first step is to make the background, and if you don't have a light green, just take a dark green and mix it with some yellow and you'll kind of get like a very similar color. This part is pretty easy, just take a smaller brush and take a darker green and just add some textures on top of the first layer. Paint this whole area with your dark green. Make sure that it's not very close to black. Use black to give a rocky kind of shape. I'm just giving an impression that there's a rock here, which is why I'm not going to get into painting the details. On the left here, I just blended this part into the layer because that area is going to be covered by leaves. To do this part, you'll need a square brush. Take some white acrylic paint and make sure there's a little bit more on the tip of the brush. To make the waterfalls, we're using the dry brush technique. You have to make sure you don't have a lot of water mixed with acrylic. It's better to take acrylic only and just try painting.
Don't worry if one of your lines goes out. You can take black later and just paint over it. I feel like this one messed up a little bit, but I'll show you guys a way on how to fix it if you mess up. You can paint a rock in the front to cover it up. I also feel like this waterfall was too thick, so I just took black and made it thinner. Now it's time to add the leaves and greeny texture. Take light green, and if you don't have light green, try to mix a dark green with some yellow. Repeat these steps on the right side as well. Time to paint some branches. I'm using black but you can use like a dark brown if you want. Take some very light green and paint some leaves on your branch. You can use any color for the flowers. I think pink really stands out with the rest of these colors. For the water, using turquoise is a good idea. Or you can mix some green and blue. That's what I pretty much did.
thank you for watching guys i'll see you in my next video